video of a babysitter screaming at their three-month-old. They say they hired the woman through a well-known babysitting service, and she seemed good with both of their children until they left her alone. Tonight, they're speaking to our Heather Lee, sharing a warning for other parents tonight. Emotions escalating quickly as a ring security camera rolls on this babysitter hired to take care of two young kids. The parents helpless as they watch the screaming ordeal unfold on their phones. You're not hungry. You don't want to lay down. What do you want, bro? What? I was just as confused as, as, as anyone else. I mean, I, I almost had to check and see if there was anybody else in the room. Exactly. Nothing. You just want me to stand up. I was angry. I was, I was hurt. Like Scott and Tanisha Marsden say they found this babysitter on the popular caregiving site, Sitter City. Scott rushed home as soon as he saw what was happening. The most disturbing part is, is probably just that it seemed like it was on the verge of, of it getting physical. Oh, yes. The company Sitter City says it conducts thorough background checks that includes running the caregiver's motor vehicle records and references. In this case, they say everything came back clean. Tanisha says for the first four weeks, she was still at home on maternity leave. So the babysitter was only alone with the kids for about two weeks. She seemed to, to, to you know, interact well with the kids while we were around. A representative from Sitter City says the babysitter had only been on the site since November of 2020 and that the Marsdens were the only family she had connected with. The babysitter has since been removed from their platform. Scott and Tanisha are thankful they had cameras. It could have been so much worse, and I think that the cameras helped prevent a disaster. They say for now they are done with babysitters, but say if someone is having a hard time taking care of a child, they should call the parents right away and let them know instead of letting a situation like this escalate. Heather Lee, ABC Action News.